Welcome friends to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you where you can try to acquire the schematics for a lifelike mechanical toad. To get started, you want to be in the Eastern Kingdom and you want to locate this area. We're going to Burning Step. Then we are going to find the dungeon location for Blackwing Lair. To locate this raid entrance, you want to fly up the side of the mountain and you want to locate the entrance right here. Now I have noticed that this ended up being kind of glitchy for me because I've actually done this a couple of times of coming in here to where it takes a second for the raid entrance to actually appear and then once it does you go in and it teleports you to somewhere completely different. If you end up getting teleported all the way down here just fly back up to the mountain and try entering the instance again Second time always seems to work for me, so hopefully you don't have this issue, but if you do, just try again. And while you're flying back, the fun fact about the lifelike toad is that talented engineers have created an exact replica of a wood frog at only 10 times the cost of buying the real thing. Hmm. As mentioned at the beginning of this video, we are actually coming into Blackwing Lair to go to the very last boss because he is the one that will drop you a chance, a 0.6% chance, mind you, of getting the engineer schematic in order to make the lifelike mechanical toad. So the prerequisite for all of this is you're going to not only have to hope that the engineering schematic drops, but you're also going to need an engineer that is able to actually learn it and be able to make you this frog. Now that you've made it to the very last boss, which means you have to kill all of the other bosses and the dragons that are flying around, you jump down here and you fight a shadow of Anixia. Eventually he'll end up flopping down. Go ahead and kill what's down here. I don't know if that's actually what you need to do, but that's what I did because I honestly don't know what I'm doing in here. Because, you know, heaven forbid I read what I need to do in Black and Lair. So here he is, Book is Snoop. And hopefully he gives you what you want. And of course, he did not drop me an engineering schematic, which is a bummer. Also, a side note, I have no idea how you get out of being down here, so I ended up hearthing. If you actually know, let me know down in the comments how I'm supposed to get out of here, because I legit could not find the exit. Well, let's go see how much the lifelike mechanical toad is selling for on the auction house, because this was just kind of... Whew, probably expensive. Also a fun side note, if you happen to be an engineer, there's actually an auction house in Oribos. So something to keep in mind. Now let's see how much this toad is selling for. Well, let's see here. The toad is selling for 1400 gold. I'm actually quite surprised by that, especially since it's very hard to acquire the schematic, but also the schematic is going for 12,000 gold. Hui, it gets really expensive super quick. Hmm, I might actually just end up buying the toad here in the auction house because, to be honest, oh, I don't think I'm going to have luck with RNG here. It's also worth noting that if you actually were lucky enough for the schematic to drop, that the parts in order to make the lifelike mechanical toad are actually pretty easy to acquire. So if you were lucky enough to get it to drop, you could actually probably make yourself some gold here. Just something to keep in mind. Well, like I always say, it's your gold, you do with it as you will. I'm just thinking for time efficiency wise, it might just be easier to buy it on the auction house. Hopefully you found this video helpful. If you did, please give it a like and I look forward to seeing you in the next pet video. Have a good one.